not this one. No, this one looks horrible. Yeah, this one looks good. So hey guys, I hope you're doing well. This is Ankit Bhatia and welcome back to my channel. So today we're gonna talk about subtitles. But before I do, I have an important thing to share with you. Yes, this bag. You know, I've been waiting for this bag for so long. I've been trying to find like perfect bag for me where I can just keep my camera, my DSLR, drone, gimbal, everything in just one bag along with laptop. And I'm really excited I got it today. So that's about it. And the next thing is, next week I'm going to Leh Ladakh for 10 days. You know, last time I went to Leh Ladakh in 2015 and at that time I didn't know anything about camera. I didn't know anything about editing. And the place was so beautiful, but I couldn't capture much. You can see that the first two videos I uploaded on my channel was from Leh Ladakh and it was just, just not good and this time i'm traveling with all my gears and i'm really excited for this one now let's talk about this video subtitles you know it's part of geography when you're making your videos in local language you just want to add subtitles so this video is going to help you now there are two ways to do it in premiere pro one is using the titles i used to do it long back and it's really time consuming so i'll tell you an easy way to do it now let's go to premiere pro and i'll show you but before i do i want to say one thing that never add subtitles in the main project now once you're done with the project just export that video and then create a new project and then just drag this video into the new project onto the timeline and then keep on adding subtitles so let's go to premiere pro and i'll show you what i'm talking about okay guys let's say this is your final video and you're done with adding editing and you have exported the video and this is your final cut and now you want to add subtitle to this video so what you will do is you will go here and right click go to item select captions and there are different options here so for now i'm gonna go with the open captions so this will keep it as default one and you can select the default settings here and just click ok make sure you select here open captions so just click ok and now you can drag this onto this layer and just zoom in using the plus sign and you can extend it for the entire video so that's what you will do now you will zoom in and select the settings here go to the captions and you can select the settings here let's say i want to select calibri and let's say the different options here bold bold italic light I'm just gonna go with the regular one and the next thing you will do is you will select the size I like 45 you can change accordingly so just select 45 these are the global settings that I'm setting right now also you can change the background color here as well go here background color and just click this right now it's black you can change it let's say red so this will change the background color also you can change the opacity here as well as you can see that you can keep it zero if you don't want any background color set it to zero so you can see that now you're not seeing anything now i'm just gonna go with the default one select here and select the black and select the opacity as let's say 50 percent and that's about it and also you can change the color of the text here as well just click here text color and you can change it for example i want to select yellow you can keep it yellow so for now i'm just gonna keep it as white these are the defaults one now you can start writing your captions let's say from here let's say from here voiceover starts so just drag this down to get a clear idea now let's say no not this one okay so i'm saying here no not this one so just type in here no not this one so this is your first one and you can drag it from where voiceover starts let's say from here and end it just drag it here here it ends so this will be your first one let's say no not this one and now let's go to second one and just tap here plus sign you will get a new one and just drag it from where it starts here to here and just listen to it no this one looks horrible okay this one looks horrible no this one looks horrible so this will be your second one and and similar way you can do it for the third one as well just go here plus sign and you can listen to it and drag it now zoom out the video using minus sign and just drag it 
till here and similar way you can write in here as well now also one more thing you can do here is you can change the position as well let's say i want to select here here so this will change for every subtitle as you can see that this is the first one this is the second one so these are the global settings i'm just gonna set it here so this will set it for full subtitles now let's say you're done with your complete subtitles and you want to change some global settings so what you will do is you will select all here select first one and select the last one and using the shift just click it so this will select it every box and now you can change it let's say i want to change the size here to 20. so you will select it 20 and this will change it for every subtitles as you can see that i'm just gonna set it here as default 45 for me so now we got it back so that's how you will do it it's so simple to do it now once you're done with your complete project you can go here and export the video just like the in point and select the out point go here export it media and you will see that we have a subtitles here and you can just select the default settings h.264 match source high bitrate and just export it so you'll get these subtitles with the video so guys that's about it if you like this video then please give it a thumbs up to the video and subscribe to the channel and also you can suggest me in the comments below what are the topics that you want me to cover and i'll cover in the future videos so with that said i'll just sign off and i'll see you next time till then take care bye bye